so tonight I'm at this Premier Inn in workshop uh, and it's actually a brand new hotel this so the rooms have got air conditioning um, yeah and it's advertised as a new hotel so this is what you get tonight for £91 well let's go and have a look around eh so I have checked in already there's free parking at this one they do offer free Wi-Fi but pretty bad can't use it it's a bit different to what it normally is there's no reception you actually have to check in yourself so you do it now on this machine so you check in you type your name in or your booking reference and you do it all yourself so yeah, and if you need help you just got to ring a bit different this is how it's all going to go in the future isn't it you even got your tea and coffee out here. Just waiting for you to take it. Okay then, so I'm in room 226. Let's go and have a look. I've just put my bags in. So. Right, so straight away as you walk in, you go put your key in the slot. So, what do we get? Not the lights on, eh? There we go. Right, so we've got a bit of a mirror here with one of the new lights and dressing area there. We've got some pillows in a bag. These are new hair dryers. I've not seen these before. So a purple Premier in the hair dryer. Some unstealable hangers there. And a big full length mirror. But I can tell straight away this is a really small room. So this is a new build hotel, obviously. Kind of like chopped it in a bit. So it's quite small. Right, nice big king size bed. Got a decent headboard there, a bit of a sex light above. Uh, purple mood light, whatever you want to call it. But this room has got air conditioning. So you've actually got a panel here. You can set the temperature of it just on there. It's good to see that we've got plug sockets right by the bed. And there's also USB charging on one side as well. So really good. Now they've updated these tables recently, they used to be just ones that always fell over, but they're a bit different now. So, uh, they're okay, they serve a purpose totally. But it's quite compact in here, there's no bag stand, so I've had to put my bag on the desk. So if you want to work your way, where are you going to put your bag? People always go on at me for these, uh, saying there's no bag stand, is it an issue? Well, yeah it is. Where else are you meant to put your bag? You're only here for one night generally, so you're not going to unpack it and put it in that wardrobe. Well, you couldn't anyway because there's only four hangers. So, where are you going to put it? Yeah, so it's on the desk it is. I mean, you could put it on this chair, but then you can't sit on the chair. It's a bit pointless, isn't it? Right then, so, desk, Wi-Fi. Mm. So, Premier in Wi-Fi, you get a free Wi-Fi when you check in. You can upgrade it for five quid. To the ultimate one but it's no good it's the free wi-fi is just useless it's that slow i've done a few videos now with the wi-fi speeds so i don't think you're gonna need to do it right so what have we got uh we've got pg tips tonight some kenko i haven't touched any of this this is how it's been arranged cups facing the right way around now is the kettle clean tonight i should hope it would be saying it's a new hotel so let's have a look Oh my god, no it is not. It's green. Ugh, what's been in that? Got green mould or whatever it is. Some thick soapy scum at the bottom. That is not nice. So a brand new hotel and the kettle is disgusting. Just shows you you need to check all the time. Right, big TV there. What else have we got? So bathroom. You don't get the baths now in the new hotels. It's the rainfall shower. So I'm okay with that because I'm here for one night. So that's absolutely fine. But they have upgraded the soap, soap that they give you. It used to be just some green stuff and now it's Bailey's and Harding. But there is a rainfall shower with loads of pressure. So yeah, happy with that. It does go straight to temperature as well. And they've got one of these sliding Premier in um, shower screens. But, again, what makes it feel cheap is this 
toilet roll. So it's not actually toilet roll, it's toilet sheets. So you just get one sheet at a time. But when you're paying £91 for a room, you know, I just think how much is toilet roll? Is he really that skint worthy to use this stuff? I know it costs cutting, but yeah, this it's just not good really, is it? I, I personally just prefer toilet roll. Right then, so the whole hut area is brand new. So it's on a, a retail park. Uh, we've got quite a few eateries around. So we've got KFC, Dunkin' Donuts, Taco Bell, McDonald's, all the fat shops. <laughs> You're definitely not going to lose any weight eating there. And there's also a beef eater downstairs too. So yeah, let's go and have a look around. So I have just noticed when I've been looking around on this pillow. So there's a black mark just here. I don't know if you can see it on camera. And then another one just here on the blanket. So that's not good, is it? Okay, let's go on, uh, go on and stay and have a look around. I'm going to go to get some sweet, I think. Okay, so it has to go beef eater on site. I'm going to go and get some food. Uh, me and my colleague are going to get some of it, so let's go and have a look in. Right then, so next day now, I actually slept pretty good in this bed. Uh, really, really comfy. Um, no issues with the bed whatsoever. I never do. But, shower, shower is good. Um, so, it turns out the rainfall bit just sprays water everywhere, so I use the other shower head, which was fine. Um, yeah, not a bad stay. Big negative though is the Wi Fi. So the Wi-Fi is shocking. It's unusable. The only thing you can use it for is browsing. Uh, so if you want to watch anything, which is everyone watches on the phone now, you, you just can't. It's awful. So they force you to have the ultimate Wi-Fi. So is that any good when you're paying 90 or quid for a room already and they want you to pay extra for Wi-Fi? This is what annoys me. Uh, this is why I don't like Premier Inns. So, I'm just trying to screw you over. Uh, right, I'm here for work, so why do I want to pay extra? My work's paid for the room, and they're not willing to pay for the Wi-Fi. So that's me who's got to pay, and it's just annoying me. Right, I'm going to try breakfast today. Uh, let's have a look. Yeah, so we've actually got a proper coffee machine, with real milk, which is good. Uh, and all your tea there. Okay, so this is Continental. I've just been told that they don't have any orange juice because they can't get it. So, yeah. Just apple juice today. And then all these yogurts here. And then this is a full breakfast to go. Just dig in. Right then, so that's it for this one, guys. That was a Premier in workshop. So, let me know in the comments below what you think. Would you stay here? What do you think about the Wi Fi? Is it actually a thing to be moaning about? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not done already. So I can help it to get to uh, a thousand subs. Till the next one.